guys, Bites here, time to find out what's cooking on this sort of rebooting of the series. So basically what I'm going to do now is I'm changing the name of the series for a couple of reasons. So first of all, um, it's because the daily special was when I started and I was doing random different things. And you know, daily special is kind of different things every day. So, And this has kind of been more, this has just been all VGC pretty much. I mean, it's what it's been. Um, also, it's not going up daily, right? So there's no why am I why should I call it the daily special? It's not going to be going up daily. So this is simply doing VGC stuff. So this is going to be called simply VGC is what the name of this new series is. So this is episode number one of our simply VGC series. So this is basically going to be B going to battle spot, doing doubles, and that's how it's going to work. So as you guys can see, I'm bringing a pretty standard VGC ish team, as at least it was. It's pretty standard. Um, compared to that gravity team that I brought that I was using last time. That was just a fun team I wanted to try. But now we're bringing serious VGC team. So we have our Leftovers Landorus. We have our Assault Vessel Conkeldur. We have our Mega Gardevoir. We have our competitive Citrus Berry Milotic. We have our Rocky Helmet Defensive Zapdos. And we have our Weakness Policy Aegislash. So we're hitting that challenge button and see how this team is going to do. I haven't actually played VGC in quite a while. Uh, quite a little bit. So let's hopefully get the, you know, get a little... Get that, get a little, get that rust out of there. As we're going up against Joker from Germany, he's going to be our first opponent, and he is bringing a Halucha, a Charizard, most likely Y, because he's got the Gudra. Why would you double dragon? I don't know. Sun doesn't really help the Swampert though. Um, the Gudra, the Scissor, and the Meow Stick. Oh gosh, Meow Stick. Prankster Meow Stick is going to be fun. Prankster Meow Stick is going to be fun, which is what, which actually makes me want to lead with my, my, uh, my Master Sword, just because of that. And I don't have the taunt on anything, I just realized that, that I don't actually have, ooh, I should have actually made this team a little better, because I don't have Fake Out or Taunt. And that's not good. That is not good. Um. Hmm. Mm hmm hmm. Oh, that meow stick is gonna be a problem. So I'm gonna lead with Master Sword and Gardevoir. I know he's gonna swagger. And we can bring let's see Charizard, we can bring the Zapdos for you. And Lucha, Flying Fighter. Zapdos takes care of you. I don't have any oh energy ball and the uh, the Gardevoir. And heat wave, okay. I'll bring the Landorus. Yeah, yep, yeah, that's what we're gonna bring. That's what we're gonna bring. He doesn't have any defiant or competitive users, so that's pretty good, at least on my part. My part of this. And we can see who he's going to lead off with. And Joker. Who are you leading off with? Who are you leading off with, Joker? Set off with the PSU good and the Golark. Um, that, yep, kind of actually pretty predictable lead that I wanted to, that I, that I thought. Pretty predictable. I'm going to trace the prankster, because that's awesome, because I totally have any status moves that I can do. Um, so. What hidden power do I have on my Aegislash? I think it's ice. Oh, that's, so I made this team such a long time ago that I don't even remember. Okay, all right. Um, I have a. F I think you're going to. You're gonna make evolve in heat wave. That's the thing. That's the thing, and you're going to. That's the thing. Okay, well. I don't have much of a choice here. I'm gonna shadow ball Pisiogen, and I'm going to mega evolve and protect, um, with the guard of war, because. I'm predict. I'm hoping this is prediction is correct. I'm predicting him to swagger my Gardevoir because it's obvious that the Charizard will will uh, get the heat wave off. And oh, I think I'm EV'd correctly. I think this is my, oh, oh, I may have just made a boo-boo. I don't remember what Aegislash this is, if this is my EV correctly Aegislash. We're going for the fake out, interesting. Okay. Oh, Master Sword avoided it! Oh, Master Sword coming through! 
Master Sword coming through. I'm pretty sure this is my EV'd one that will live. Okay. It's going to prop its citrus. Um, pretty sure this is the EV'd one. So obviousness of obviousness. I'm going to King Shield because there's no way in heck that I'm not. And we can just go for the Hyper Voices. We can just go for... So that's unfortunate she went for the Fake Out. Well, it doesn't matter either way. Doesn't matter either way. That miss, uh, I'm not sure if it really mattered. Actually, that miss might have actually been bad because I'm pretty sure that I am EV to actually be able to live a, uh, a uh, heat wave from the Charizard. Why? Because it's split damage. Had I lived that, I would have got the weakness policy off and this Meow Stick would have been dead. So we're going to see. Okay, we do break through the Swagger Confusion. Suck it, you little son of a whore. Using swaggerness, I hate it so much. It's gonna go for the heat wave, and that is going to happen, and that's gonna do. Oh my gosh, that does so much damage. And now what's unfortunate is that I'm still swaggered. That is what's unfortunate. Swampert's gonna come out. Interesting. Interesting. So, um, yeah, I definitely gotta save. Definitely, I outsped the Charizard, so that's good to know. Um, it must. I think. Are we speed tied? Let me take a look here. Let me take a look, sees. Let me take a look, sees. Uh, I think we might be speed tied, so I might have just won that speed tie. But in any case, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna switch. Oh no, wait, hold on. I just went for the King Shield right now. So we'll find out right now if I'm going to live the the thing, and then we're gonna switch out into switch out into. Actually, oh, that was actually pretty dumb. Eggslash is going to die. Eggslash is going to die right now. Because it's going to... Ooh, yeah, I can't live a heat wave in an earthquake. I just realized that. Yeah, that was... Uh, that was silliness. Because I know I don't outspeed the... Oh, okay, I'm not EV... I'm not... This is not my Master Sword that is EV'd correctly at all. Not EV'd at all correctly. Okay, we're going to get... Uh, that. So that was a wasted turn. At least. Oh my god, that did so much damage. That did so much damage. Okay. Alright, well, we can go out into the batteries of the birds. We can go out into this, and I'm going to actually just double protect to waste the sun. I'm just going to double protect to waste the sun. Uh, we're going to protect. And protects. No reason to not double protect. Yeah, you're going to protect. That's fine. That's fine. Um... That is fine. Because I'm going to protect all around. It protects for everybody. Protects for everybody. But this lets you know who outspeeds who. The Charizard is unfortunately the fastest thing on the... Oh, he's got the Ice Punch. Okay. Okay. So Charizard is unfortunately the fastest thing on the field. Um, and the sun is still up. <laughs> Alright, well Thunderbolt... That's unfortunate. I thought the sun would be gone by now. Um, and I have to get to try to go for the double protect. That's the only chance I have here. That's the only chance. Oh, he's going to withdraw the Golurk. Oh, that's unfortunate. Going to Vast Cocoon. Gudra, which is going to eat that up. Don't get the double protect off. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Smart. This is a smart VGC player. Because he's switching out the goaler just in time to be able to get the sun back up. Because it's going to fade right now. And we have got nothing for... We have this God of War. And... I mean, I outspeed everything on the field, so... My only choice here is to go for a Heat Wave and a Hyper Voice because that'll at least do the that'll do the most damage to everything. That'll do the most damage for everything. Alright, that thing is going to protect. Okay. Are you double protect? Okay, we're going to Hyper Voice. So it's going to hit Swamp X, which is going to... Wow, that is a freaking fully def specially defensive... Fully specially defensive, uh... 
Well then. Well then, that's unfortunate. Because that did nothing. Wow, had I figured, had I had I gone for the the energy ball? Wasn't, I should have predicted, yeah, that was bad. Okay, well, there's no reason in playing anymore. Uh, we lost, so that's unfortunate. If I gone for the energy ball, it would have been GG, because you would have brought in the Charizard. We had to a speed tide. Uh, well, I would have protected with the they're protected with the uh, the uh, Gardevoir when it came in, just because of why not? actually, there's no point in protecting. There's no point in protecting um, because it's a fresh set of sun. So that's kind of unfortunate. That's unfortunate that we lost. Like I said, I'm rusty, guys. I'm rusty. I saw rusties. So we're gonna go for one more battle and see if we can pick up the victories. And, uh, that, yeah, I could have played that so much better. So much better in so many places. All right, Mr. Falcon uh, from the U.S. of A. Finally summoned from America. We are battling. I don't think it's been, it's been forever. You were bringing a Dragonite, an Electros, a Fufuru, a Clawitzer, a Sableye, and a Lucario. Huh. It's a very, very interesting team. But what I do see is that a lot of Pokemon get hit. I spray a Hyper Voice. A lot of Pokemon get hit nice by a Hyper Voice. So, I guess I'm gonna lead with Gardevoir. And I'm gonna bring the Conk for the Mock Punch. This. And Clawitzer takes. I can take you with my Battery Bird. Yeah. Uh, who do I wanna lead? Who do I wanna lead? Who do I wanna lead with? Um. I'm actually thinking about yeah. I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna bring I'm gonna Master Sword and Conk Elder. Yep. They're bringing three of the same Pokemon. Uh, let's see how uh, that turns out. Not entirely sure. But we'll find out, won't we? We will find out, won't we? And uh, we're gonna see. We have some um, things and stuff. Nujas Dirklaw and something else. Something else. Okie dokies. Okie dokies. I'm gonna trace. Mega Launcher! Oh boy! Alright, now we're freaking. Everything is gonna be able to do lots of stuff. Alright, so we can go for a nice hyper voice. Nice and hyper voice. And we can go for the. See, what's the bigger threat? The Electros or the Clodzer? Most likely the Clodzer. Yeah, because I have. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Clodzer. I'm gonna go for the Shadow Ball and the Clawitzer. I'm gonna go for the Shadow Balls and the Clawitzers. I don't know if my Ega Slash is actually faster or not than the Clawitzer. I hope it's not, and he goes for a Dark Pulse on it. That would be lovely. That would be really nice if we could- oh, okay, so apparently the Ega Slash- I was gonna go for the Water Pulse, oh, okay. Which I should be able to somewhat eat that up. Let's go for the fl- oh, or just- Let me went for that on the Ega Slash. Yeah, you did. Wow. Is that an offensive- Electros, because that did a butt ton of damage. Holy crap. That did a butt ton of damage. Uh, for shield form from an Electros? Wow. That did too much damage. That did way too much damage. Um, yeah, not even Life Orb. Are you Specs? That, I mean, that did an insane amount of damage. That did an insane amount of damage. Um, I outspeed Lucario right now, so... Um... I'm just gonna go for another Hyper Voice. And King Shield on up in here. Get damn King Shield up on in here. Um, yeah, I do- I outspeed Lucario naturally by the- the, uh, the speeds. And so, unless he protects here, that's going to be a huge damage to the Lucario. No, he didn't protect, because if I seriously doubt you outspeed a Aegis Slash, went for the Bullet Punch. This is, oh, uh, okay. Okay, you're, uh, of course you're going to go for the Bullet Punch. Why would you not go for the Bullet Punch? Why would you not go for the Bullet Punch? Okay. 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 That's unfortunate. It's actually really, really unfortunate that that just happened. 
actually really, really unfortunate. Um, let's go for the heat wave. Oh, jeez, what am I going to do? For, do I want to go for T-Bolt on the Lucario or heat wave? I'll go for heat wave and shadow ball on the the uh, thingy. I'm going to bullet punch the Aegislash to get me into range for a flamethrower I might kill. Into, oh, which one missed it? The Electros missed it. Oh, that's fantastic. That's fantastic. Let's see. Are you you have to be specs. I barely live that. Oh my. We barely live that. We're gonna shadow ball off. This is plus two. I'm pretty sure you're dying. Yeah, you're dying. You are dying, so that's nice. Okay. Oh man. That was a close one. That was a close one there. That was a close one there. Trogador the Dragonite. Trogador the Dragonite. Uh, well then, we're gonna go for a Thunderbolt on the Lucario, and we're just gonna stay in, and I'm not getting your weakness policy off, uh-uh, that's not happening, and we're going to Shadow Ball the, the Dragonite. Right, okay, so you went for the Protect on the Lucario, we're gonna go for the T-Bolt, let's see, are you gonna Dragon Dance? No, you went for the Ice Punch onto the, okay, well, darn it, had I actually went for the HP Ice, uh, that would've been better, because the Rocky Helmet would've broken your... Your, uh, the thing, but that's a plus to. Oh my goodness, it just barely lives. Okay, you just barely live. Uh, you just barely. Who do I have left? I have the conk, don't I? Oh, I can mock punch. I just need to kill one of these things. So let's see. A bullet punch. I outsped the Dragonite. I just saw that, didn't I? Yeah, so I'm actually gonna go for the. Why not go for the heat wave? And the Shadow Ball onto Lucario. For the extreme... Did you, was that a misclick? It had to have been a misclick. Because there's no reason to go for... Wow, that's... Well, that's unfi it's fine. Doesn't even matter because I have a Conkeldor with a punch. Um, it had to have been a misclick. It had to have been a misclick. Um, yeah. It had to have been a misclick. I don't know why... Why you, uh... Did that. You know you... Yeah, you're just gonna lose. Yeah, okay. Mock Punch is gonna come through. That's gonna take out the Lucario. And we're going to get a victory over there. Uh, that extreme, I uh, don't. That extreme speed did not matter because it wouldn't have done that much. It would have actually done less than the ice punch did, and he would have killed himself with the uh, the rocky helmet. So it really didn't matter at all that misclick. But we actually we get a win, so at least we go one and one. So it's not too shabby. Not too shabby. Hope you guys enjoyed this new rebooting of the series. Just simply VGC. If you did, please remember to share that like button down below, and of course, maybe subscribe if you want to see more battles and stuff. Remember to also click the link to follow me on Twitter, so that way you guys know when I post updates for the channel, challenges for battle, and all those good things and stuff, and I guess I will see you guys later.